hello viewers in this video i am going to discuss about the topic wavelet packets the following topics are covered in this video introduction to wavelet packet transform construction and organization of wavelet packets comparing wavelets and wavelet packet decomposition tree three scale wft filter band three scale wavelet packet and applications of wpt so what is wavelet packet transform in general a fast wavelet transform decomposes a function into a sum of scaling and wavelet functions whose bandwidths are logarithmically related that is the log frequency content of the function is represented using scaling and wavelet functions with narrow bandwidths while the frequency high frequency content is represented using functions with wider bandwidths so if you want a greater control over the partitioning of the time frequency plane the fwt must be generalized to yield a more flexible decomposition called a wavelet packet so a wavelet packet is a generalization of orthogonal wavelet transform in wavelet packets uh, the final analysis is done by breaking up detailed space into approximation and detailed space whereas in wavelet transform these detailed spaces are not decomposed only the approximation spaces are decomposed so let us see the construction of wavelet packets we know in multi resolution analysis we use two filters with the transfer functions gn and hn to decompose the signal into detailed and approximation spaces in a similar manner for wavelet packets also we use two filters with transfer function gn and hn which are associated with orthogonal wavelet function psi of t and scaling function phi of t so as you can see in this figure the input signal w phi of j plus 1 comma n is the input signal to be processed so it is passed through a high pass filter h of phi of minus n and then decimated by a factor of 2 so after doing this we get detailed space of the input signal in the same way if we pass the signal into a low pass filter and decimate by a factor by two, factor of 2 we get approximation space so let us see how these wavelet packets are organized so the function is denoted by capital w j n where for a fixed value of j the frequency parameter n analyzes the fluctuation of the signal or the position k in this figure for a given value j equal to 3 it is shown how the wavelet packets are organized so as you can see here capital w 0 comma 0 denote the root of the binary tree that is the input signal which is decomposed into uh, decomposed into detail space and approximation space further as it is a wavelet packet the approximation space is again divided into approximation and detail space and detail space is also divided into approximation and detail space but in the case of wavelet transform only the approximation space is divided into approximation space and detail space so for some value of j the value of frequency parameters that is n ranges from 0 to 2 power j minus 1 which actually represents the position in the tree so generalizing the above concept we can say that each package function can be divided into two subspaces vj approximation space that is capital w j plus 1 comma 2n and detail space w j that is wj plus 1 comma 2n plus 1 so here is the comparison of wavelet decomposition tree and wavelet packet decomposition tree so as you can see here the key difference is in wavelet decomposition only the approximation spaces are split while in case of wavelet packet decomposition both the approximation and detail space are further splitted into approximation and detail spaces so now we are going to discuss about three scale fwt filter pack it is nothing but 
the input signal is splitted into approximation space and detail space through a number of levels so the number of levels here is 3 so the name 3 scale fwt filter band as you can see here the input signal f of x is passed through high pass filter and low pass filter followed by a decimation by a factor of 2 when it is passed through high pass filter we obtain detail space when it is passed through low pass filter we get approximation space since it is FWT, we are not going to further split the detail space. We are only going to split the approximation space. So, in the next stage, we are going to split the VG minus 1, which results into WG minus 2 and VG minus 2, and again split the VG minus 2 into WG minus 3 and VG minus 3. So, the same is represented in the form of a decomposition space tree and spectral splitting characteristics. So in a similar manner we have three scale wavelet packet decomposition. So here is the block diagram. So here both the approximation D space and detail space are split are further splitted into approximation and detail spaces. So in the in initially f of x is divided into wj minus 1 and vj minus 1 and vj minus 1 is further divided into vj minus 1 comma d vj minus 1 a and vj minus 1 is splitted into wj minus 2 vj minus 2 and for and so on the same block diagram is represented in the form of analysis tree and spectral splitting so here are the applications of wavelet packet decomposition so it is used in signal and image denoising, signal and image compression, spectral analysis, optic detection, and signal and image classification. That's the end of the video. Thanks for watching.